just made a quick ten bills. Yeah. Bitch, I just put up in the lamb. I just put up in that big boy tongue. I don't drive no miser. I don't give a fuck what you heard. You say to you poppin', but I ain't heard him. And he beat you pass me, I murder him. We finesse in this bitch and this man. My bitch pull up and buckle my pants. I took both off the track, I can't stand. Yo, what is up? So, this is not my first time making a YouTube video. This is going to be the first video on this channel, though. But it's not my first video. But, you know, I, this is this is the car channel. Like, this is when we going to do the car builds. We're going to focus on, like, the Infinity right now. Uh, I have two more cars that we're going to be working on outside of this. Well, technically three. But that one's not mine. Third one's not mine. But I'm getting something else later on in the year. And something else later on in the year can't say what but right now we got the g you know g37 this is a 2009 g37 sedan xs whatever like this that's it it's not too crazy fancy i mean the g's are pretty tough even though they do sound like the you know, like like vqs you know we got the got the the trumpet joke but that's not what we came for this video this video is really just going to be a first video you know doing some mods just going to hop right into it Maybe later on down the road, I'll make a little intro, like really introducing the car, going through the mod list of what's done to it already, what's, what's more to come. But we are now we're focusing on just the Starlight Kit, man. So I, I, I didn't buy the Starlight Kit yet. This is the first part of this video. So first, we're gonna, we got to do the prep, you know, we got to get, take everything out, take off the full roof and um, the A, B, C, A, B, and C pillars. We got to get the sunroof off, got to get just the headliner off. I have the fabric ready on, on this way. I have the spray and everything, like the headliner season spray. I'm gonna go through like the oldest products I'm using as well. So y'all gonna see that in the description below. Um, right now we're going to like the prep phase. This is just like tearing down, prepping things. Like for example, I, I went ahead just to see how easy it was. I pulled out the, uh, the, the pull handles. I'm, uh, probably, I'm probably just gonna like wash these up, make sure they're clean. Maybe give it a quick wet sand and then like just prep it to uh, be spray painted and everything. Obviously, I have like I don't just have like black spray paint. Let's see, we got this is we got the vinyl, the you know, duplex color vinyl fabric spray. Honestly, the stuff from what I hear is pretty good. I didn't check if it was black. Somebody could just put a black top on a random bottle, but I'm pretty sure this is black. Oh shit! This is not black. Oh, fuck. Black. oh we're just gonna get get into it like it's nothing much to keep talking about we're just gonna get right into it first mods on the g for the video purposes um i'm just gonna show you how to like tear down the uh like the cup like the cup, like the, the handles and i'm show you how to take off the uh the little light bar and everything we're just gonna work on that stuff stay tuned See. so we got the g ray took out one of these handles already got the curtains took out this one already this one's done we're gonna work on taking out not these just yet actually we're gonna work on just taking out the handles we're gonna get all four handles out and then i'm gonna show you all the rest of that all right so we got these they're honestly pretty easy to take out you just press down these tabs right here these pull right outwards and then you just it just falls out to be honest so let me just i'm just gonna use a screwdriver just to make it look easier I put the screwdriver in the tire. One hand is crazy. But, uh, oh, I see the struggle people work on cars to do one hand now. This is crazy. Oh, I'm just gonna use my hand. I'll use my finger. But, there you go. And that comes right out. There you go. Now you see, like that, just, just pulls right out after that. That's the first one. Let's get the second clip right here. Same tactic. Zoom in. He's pressing his tab. Don't look at my fingers too much. Let's zoom out. Ah, damn. Pull out words. Oh, this one's like stuck. All right, there we go. And that's it. Slides right out. That's the second handle. All right. So now we're back in the room, y'all. We have all four of the uh, door handles, or the inside pull handles, whatever you want to call them. We have all the interior handles pulled out. I didn't pull the lights out yet. I'm just gonna, I was gonna prep these first. Let's see how the paint looks. Let me see the sticks and everything. After we prep that, we're just gonna push on to doing the lights, doing the uh, center, uh, like controller console, and then we're just like pull on, going pulling off like pillars and stuff. I'm gonna pull off the A pillars first. Then I'm gonna do the B because I gotta do the seat belts. Like actually no, we're gonna do A and C first because we're gonna wrap those with the suede wrap. Then we're gonna pull off the um, 
B pillars and then get those like painted as well because those were the seat belt. Like the little seat belt cover area, we gotta get that painted as well. So we're gonna work on all that stuff and we're just gonna see pushing through it. Right now, I'm just gonna prep these with uh, I'm honestly just gonna probably clean them with a little bit of soap and water, then hit it with some alcohol, rub it down a little bit. I was thinking about sanding them a little bit. I mean, the car is kind of old. I don't think any of the like original, like a clear coat or anything still stuck on them. So we'll just hit it with some alcohol. I'll just like, you know, scrub it like heavily maybe. And then like, we'll see how like it holds up after that. All right, yo, what's up? So I got everything prepped already. I have, uh, I'm not gonna prior primer coat. We're not gonna do the base coat or nothing. We're just gonna just spray them up. I already cleaned everything. I wiped, I washed it. Wiped down with some alcohol just to make sure it was like, you know, getting all like residue, any like grease or anything like off there. Just like give it a quick scrub. Um, I have the fabric spray right here. Well, buying on fabric spray, whatever you wanna call it. We're gonna use that. We're gonna apply about like, probably about like two to three coats of it. Just to see how it looks. Make sure it's even out with that. And then we'll move on from there. So everything is like pretty much done. Everything's painted. All the handles are decent. Good. Everything's just gonna get one more like top coat. We're gonna do one more big, not big, but like one more light top coat pass across all of them. And then we're gonna wrap it up. And then after that, I'll probably put one in the car to see what it looked like. Just so it gets like, just to see, like see how it's gonna look when it's done. After this is done, I move on to like the lighting and stuff. We'll get those parts like painted as well. Um, I slowly started, you know, dismantling the um, the interior. I got slowly started taking things out. I'm gonna probably take out my A pillars, probably just the A pillars for now. Just the A pillars for now. We're gonna take those out, and then we'll start moving on to the lights. All right, yo. So I got honestly bored waiting for the paint to dry. So I'm just gonna take out the lighting pieces, and I'm just gonna like get those prepped. You know, paint those as well. Just to like get everything black. Once everything's black, we're gonna be good. I got one of them out because I want to see how I get out first before I start showing y'all and start struggling on camera. So we're gonna show you how to get the rest of them out. It's pretty easy, honestly. It's a lot simpler than I thought it was gonna be because I was over here struggling. But just uh, just be patient. Just don't don't pry at it with a screwdriver like I did. Anyways, moving on. All right. So I got this one out already. This is the oh shit. Oops. Oh shit. Okay. They they don't they're not. Oh, damn, I thought they were, like, stiff. I guess they're not stiff. All right. So I got that one out already. I'm going to get this one out. It's pretty easy. To take, you take the lens off first, and there's a clip in there, so I'm going to show you all that. All right, so, boom, why don't you take out the lens? You know, there's a flathead right here on this edge. Just pry it out. You're going to hit this clip right here. There's one on the opposite side. It's going to hit it, like, boom. Push the clip in. This slides out. Wait, what the fuck? Push the clip in. There you go. That part slides out. Then we'll do the same thing on the other side. Repeat. There's a clip right here. I can't really. There it is, right there. That white clip. Hit that. Boom. Slide right out. Slide right out. Okay. What's going on? What are you? What's stuck on? Oh, it's just a piece of stuff. Stuck. I right, said, so pull that. Boom. Boom. And that's that. So make sure you know you know how it works when you gotta put it back because it's gonna put it back like this. Same process. Just gonna put these in there. I'm pretty sure. So uh, this is another day now. I'm like, you know, still taking out everything out the interior, still pulling the parts. We pulled out these pillars right here, as you see. Got the uh, C pillars out. Right now, we're just focusing on getting the middle pillars out. There's no videos on YouTube how to get these out on like, anywhere. So I don't know how people have been figuring it out, but I figured it out for y'all. As you see, I got this one out right here. 
So I finally figured it out. So I'm about to take this one out to show y'all how, how the process works, how to take these out, and then we're gonna get into like wrapping stuff with the suede and everything. All right, let me have my tools, hold up. All right, first, it's gonna be this bottom piece right here, this clip. This is just a plastic clip, you can take, pull this out. After you pull that clip out, you're gonna unloosen their seatbelt bolt right here. Make sure you put it back afterwards, you need your seatbelts. Then you move on to these pillows right here. So these are just clips that hold them in, but it's mad complicated. So first you're gonna like you go squeeze this center area right here, and this squeeze inwards, and then you pull this out. So you squeeze. Like, hold on, you squeeze. <laughs> All right, we just gonna we gonna squeeze these, pull this from the top. Bro, this is hard as fuck to get out. Coming out, bro. Everything coming up with this top. All right, there we go. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? Bro. Bro. <laughs> then he just came out of the house. Bro. I can't get this shit out, bro. Oh, yo, look at that. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Can't get this out. There we go. And the whole piece is out. And you're going to leave this part because I can't get this part out. So I'm just going to paint it black by Sharpie. All right, so all of the stuff is done now. There is a worm on my speaker. I'm looking at him just crawl around. Oh, my God, here, bro. Move. Shoot. Anyways, everything is done. Everything's sprayed up. All the pieces are done. I have to go back and do one of the pieces because I left it on the newspaper for too long. So I just the, the paper just pulled all the paint off of it so had to redo one of them but nevertheless we did the, all the handles all I did the back lighting um holders i didn't do the front ones the front ones have to be done after i pull up the headliner because there is a there's just like a little plug in there i'm pretty sure that you have to like, like you know unplug obviously and that's gonna come out all together i have to do the vents for the for the, for the a pillars which is going to be these right here these plastic vents right here, I wanna get these sprayed, but we're gonna spray those as long as we do the A-Pillars with the full wrap. So that's gonna be for another day. Uh, right now we got the adhesive, the adhesive just came in, the suede just came in. So now we're just gonna be moving on to the next part of the project. We're gonna do all that stuff done. Get it, I'll get it done tomorrow. So that's part one, just, you know, simple, just tear down, wash these pieces up, paint them. Um, we know, we already know what we're gonna tackle next. That's it. I mean, we're just gonna move on. I might honestly, honestly, I might just put this in one video. We'll see. This part is be one whole video, the painting of old stuff, and then like we'll do the actual fabric stuff in another video. So stay tuned for the next video. If this is the last video, if this is end of part one, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. This is a new channel, so obviously I'm not expecting crazy views. I'm not expecting crazy numbers. This is just a a G37, yo. This is a black G with some cool mods. We're gonna, we're gonna make the G cool. You know what I'm saying? We wanna like change up the view. We're not gonna just fucking sit on the G. We're not gonna just do takeovers. We're gonna actually make this like a clean ass car. So stay tuned for all that stuff. Mods coming soon. Check y'all later.